Let's write a C program to check whether sum of square of sine and cosine of an angle is equal to 1. First we need to convert the angle from degrees to radian using the formula radian is equal to degree into pi divided by 180 where pi is 3.141592. So with this let's write our C program. I'll take floating point variables sum and assign it to 0, angle and a temporary variable. I'll ask the user to input an angle in degrees and store it inside the address of variable angle. I'll copy this user entered value to temporary variable. Now let's convert the degrees to radian that is and I'll store it back inside the variable angle itself. So angle is equal to angle into pi that is 3.14 divided by 180. We can even write m underscore pi which is a constant present in C programming language which has the pi value. Okay. So once we have this radian, I'll calculate the sum. So let me align this. Okay. So sum, I'll use power function that is present inside header file math.h. So power of sine of this angle entered by the user which has been converted to radian square using power we square it plus similarly we will do for cosine I think we have entered one extra bracket you find it out so if sum is equal to 1 in most cases almost all cases the sum will be 1 so sum of square of sine of percentage I'll do 0 0.2 f and cos of percentage 0 0.2 of f is 1 so temp we have the angle entered by the user we have stored it inside temporary variable so else it's not one okay so that's it let's try to compile it before that let's add math.h header file now save it and let's compile it okay we have an extra brackets here so which is present here near cause so let me remove that save it and compile once again okay so let me remove this let me save and compile it i think it should grow through okay it's working fine so angle 45 so sum of square of sine 45 and cos 45 is one so similarly for 60 degrees it's one two similarly for 75 degrees again it's one let's check for 90 degrees so again it's one so please visit the link present in the description section of this youtube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic please stay subscribed to our youtube channel and blog share this video with your friends online and please do not forget to like this video on youtube thank you